UK is going to leave the EU, uh, Minister uh, Short, how do you see the UK exit will impact your economy and, in broad sense, the European economy? I think that uh, will not have a big impact that the UK will have left the European Union in some days, and especially not because we avoided a hard Brexit. So this was the key question, which was also having effects on the confidence of people in the business sector, whether they should invest or not, that they were not sure about that question. So uh, there is a task left, which is uh, to now get the agreement about the further relationship between, between the European Union and the UK. But if this is also managed, I'm absolutely confident that, especially on the continent, to say it from the British view, uh, there will be no negative effect of this development. Um, it will be more difficult for the UK, ob obviously, because the business model must be reorganized. Um, there will be a lower um, importance, though it will be still be a very big place of financial activities in London, but it will be different as it has been today, as, as it is today, and this all will have some uh, consequences we will see in the next years. Um, I think for Europe, the more important question is that we continue with what is already agreed between then President Juncker and President Trump about uh, discussions about trade. I'm relatively confident that we will be successful with this because anyone knows that a free trade is something that is uh, causing wealth. And for Europe, there are some tasks to be solved which are now on the table one of them is forming banking union and capital market union because I think we have lower growth as we would have if we would have done this uh, task or if we solved this task already. Uh, there will be even better interest rates if the money could be used at many places in Europe and not, it is not that difficult as it is today. So we need this development and also for having more equity in financing comp companies as we have not in Europe today. There is a complete difference between the United States and Europe. It's 80% equity financing in the United States. It's 20% in Europe. And if we could narrow this a bit, this would have a good effect on growth in, 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 in Europe. But uh, the Brexit, I think, will not have a negative effect.